All right, we've set up a production line for our bottling. We've got our beer in our plastic pail. We've got our bottles all lined up to bottle into, and Helene's got our bottle capper and our sanitized bottle caps. We're going to start our siphon, fill our bottles. Helene's going to cap them, rack them off into our boxes, and we're going to put them away in cellar for a little bit, let them get good and tasty. So we... Uh, we sanitized, we rinsed and sanitized our siphon from earlier. We put our little tip back on our pipette that works up and down to fill the bottles and regulate flow so we don't need to cap either end. When you grab this, you want to get your hands down in a little bit of sanitizer. I'm gonna pass that over to Tim. You're gonna want to put this in down into your bucket. You can put it all the way in your bucket and then he's gonna start filling some bottles. Of course, we're gonna get rid of this first bit of bleach water into a glass. Once you have your line all purged, we're going to start filling. The advantage to using this is you fill from the bottom up, which reduces foam greatly. And stops agitation. And stops Which leads to oxidization. Oxidigenation? Oxidigenation. It's those multi-syllable words that kill me every time. And a good unit of measure here is fill all the way to the top. That way when you take your pipette out, you have enough headspace. And the headspace is going to be really important because this is where your CO2 is going to build up from your natural carbonation. Okay, I'll take this first bottle. Here's my bottle catheter. <laughs> catheter? Bottle catheter. Catheter. <laughs> catheter, that's what you said it was called, right? We have a magnet on this, so my cap's going to stick right to that. Put it on there. Right on top. Push down, pull back up, and it's on there. The satisfying the box she goes. Of beer. Yeah, this is the fun part. You no, know, the fun part's when we drink it. Well, besides that. But this is still fun. My job is hardest. Live out your personal dream of being Laverne and or Shirley.